Hey, what's up, everyone, and welcome to the Salt Mines on this Tuesday morning. How the hell is everybody doing? What's up, Sonic? True Prime, how you guys doing today? I hope you're doing well. We are back to do more Resident Evil Revelations, and this game has been really good so far. I didn't know what to think about it at first, because some of the chapters go by really quick, and it bounces around a lot here and there, but... It's been a really fun Resident Evil game to play. Definitely better than RE5 or 6. It's kind of somewhere in between what I like 4 and 7. But it is, it's been really good so far. True, you're not doing well at all. Oh no, what's wrong? Hopefully nothing too serious. Ooh, well... Hope nothing too serious. Um, all right, so really quick here. Um, I think True's probably going to be typing in what's going on. And you don't have to, True. No pressure. But definitely wanna, want you to be doing okay. I got my business cards in the mail today from Moo. Amazing company. If you guys saw it on Discord or maybe in the Twitter, you saw pictures of them. And it wasn't until... LMK happened to point out that I spelled variety wrong. I mean, it is a proper spelling of the wrong version of variety. So, yeah, that sucks. I called Moo, because apparently they opened at 3 a.m. Eastern, told them about it. I wasn't sure what they were going to be able to do with anything, because it was my mistake. And they told me, don't worry about it. We'll correct it. We're going to ship it out to you, and you'll get a, a whole new order. And I'm like, I really need it by Thursday, though, because I'm going to TwitchCon. And they're like, okay, we can uh, we can make sure you get it by Wednesday. We'll next day air it, and we'll do this for you, no charge, just because they're an amazing company. Can you believe that? I was blown away for something that was my own mistake. They went and completely redid my entire order. And are sending it out to me Wednesday, so I have it in time for TwitchCon. Blown away by them. Amazing business card and other, they do other stuff too, but Moo.com. You guys got to check them out. Really fucking amazing company. They do really great work. All their stuff is beautiful. Best business cards I've ever seen anybody do. And they have a lot of choices if you guys uh, need some business cards of your own. Fancy broke up with me. Oh, shit. True. Fuck. I am so goddamn sorry to hear that. That's really shitty. Wow. I, I, I'm deeply, deeply, honestly sorry to hear that. That's, that's horrible. Um, like, I don't expect you to go into the details on stream, and, and I'm not going to pretend to know either way but I'm trying to think of how I can best word some of this because I don't want to sound cold and or flip about the whole situation because I mean I can imagine how bad that sucks um you know I mean maybe one way one way to try to look at it um granted I don't know what happened between the two of you so I can only make assumptions but I mean, if they broke up with you before they got married, maybe maybe that's ultimately going to end up being a good thing. And I mean, that's probably the shittiest thing to hear right now while you're going through this. Cause you don't want anybody to fucking hear it, say that shit. I wouldn't want to hear it. But, um, damn true. I'm so sorry. I feel for you. I really do. Um, God, that's horrible. Smog, that's awesome person. It was it was really surprising. I, I didn't expect that from Moo at all. And let me go ahead and actually throw a shout out to them in, in chat here. Moo.com. You guys want to check them out. They do amazing stuff. And their first orders from them, they usually do pretty deep decent discounts. If you got a student ID, they do even more discounts. And their stuff is like the best quality you can imagine. They have all sorts of cards, different sizes. Just really, really great company. 
You couldn't even sleep last night because when I closed my eyes, she was there. Ah, oh, true. I can imagine. I really can. Like, like that's horrible. Was it something that recently happened? Like, uh, was this something that happened yesterday? All right. So, to try to, not that this is, I'm sure, going to do terribly much for you. Get your mind off it as much as possible. Let's start to jump into the game here, and I'll keep reading chat. You guys know me. I'm pretty chat-focused. But, um... Get, so get something else going on screen here besides me. Yeah, yesterday. Fuck. You think there's any hope there? I mean, granted, I, I don't expect you to go into details on stream. I mean, not asking you to to air out your laundry or say anything that you don't want to say. Although at the same time, if, if you do feel like talking about it, my, I like to think my chat is a fairly free, open place to talk about whatever. Um, at least that's the community I'm trying to build. But do you think there's any, any hope there? I mean, do you, was it just like a rash thing? Maybe just a misunderstanding or maybe you guys had like some sort of fight and you can, you can work it out. Oh, wrong mouse. There we go. Sonic, so I found out I can get a 1080 Ti for about 700 brand new or 620 refurbished through EVGA. If credit approved, I can pay it off about $70 a month for a year with 0% APR. It'll also give me about 60 frames more in versus your normal 780. I mean, yeah, the set the 1080 Ti versus a 1070 is actually a huge jump in performance, so that's pretty bad. Uh, Sonic, in all honesty, depending on what kind of warranty they have, I would absolutely get EVGA refurbished. They're an amazing company, and they really stand by their stuff. So, I mean, if, if that refurbished car comes with a decent uh, length warranty, I would absolutely go with that one. They'll stand by it if it breaks, they'll replace it. I've seen people with like older cards, like there's one person I knew, like their 7, 760 or something, I think it was a 760 broke. And of course they didn't make 760s anymore at that point. So EVJ is like, all right, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna send you a 1070 to comp you because it was, the other card was still under warranty. A 1070? for a 760. It's huge. They could have given them a 1060, but they gave them a 1070. It's a really fucking amazing company they are. It's more complicated than that. Oh. Uh, 1080 Ti for when you need the ultimate 1080p experience. <laughs> Essentially, right? 11 years, and now I feel like I've been pushed off a building. Resident Evil. Revelations. Hey, what's up, Dark Fantasy? How you doing today? True, I really do feel you. Like, me and my girl, we've been going out a little bit longer than, than that, but not much. And, I mean, I, I think if, if that ever happened, like, I, I can just kind of feel your pain just trying to go through it. I mean, granted, I'm not going to BS you too much and and say I'm, I'm, you know, exactly feeling it because I'm sure I... I can't fully experience what you're going through, but that sucks. That really sucks. I'm so sorry. It's bloody cold! Nine Celsius today. Damn, that is pretty fucking cold. Can you turn the music down, please? What music? There's no... There's no music. Can you guys not hear me too well? I know this game is like really quiet, so I bumped it up a bit, but if it's too loud, I can try to turn it down a bit. All right, so we're gonna do continuation, load game. Here we go, this should be it right here. Oh, I guess we can just do continue. Previously, on Resident I'll let you guys Evil watch this previously. The 
ice is the tea of this virus. We are equipped to infect one fifth of the Earth's waters. Damn terrorists. Now they want to use the virus to stage another attack. They seek the truth about Terra Grecia. And vengeance. Raymond! That corpse you ran into earlier? Send a team to Valcoin and Mock Airport. Look for something linked to this ship. I'll send Quinn and Keith. Uh, I hate Snow. Snow hates you. Just find out anything you can on Veltro. God may have a plan for everything, but this is pretty fucked up. Uh, plan, sorry about your... Don't be sorry about your language. They're, this is an 18 or over stream. You can say mostly anything in my chat as long as it's not... I mean, you guys read the rules, I assume. Or at least you agreed to them. <laughs> I don't know how many people actually read them. But, yeah, you, you can pretty much say whatever the fuck you want in the, in the chat. I only uh, censor shit that's like racist or homophobic or if you're talking shit to somebody else either in chat or another streamer like uh, that's the only stuff i, I really the situation. i really the cut out token you found hey what's up indo how you doing today boss have you heard from jill and parker yet no not yet their investigation led them out to sea yeah but we lost track of the ship that doesn't sound good i did turn it down they're okay yeah, me too. They've been out of contact too long, and I'm starting to get worried. Find a terminal at the crash site. You're See still you sick, Indo? Holy crap. The crash site's just up ahead. Come on. Wouldn't it be great, Grinder, if we find the key to ending this whole mission? God, that guy jackass is a jackass. Seems to happen every time you it's find someone. Out for this I time mean. Of night. I guess that's why they call it the Midnight Sun. I'm trying to figure out just how to word everything, because I, I know how hard this must be for you. I mean, the fact that it lasted that long for you is pretty amazing. Um, especially with, with how a lot of things are today, sadly. I mean, that's a sad state of affairs. And uh, I know you said it's complicated, so I don't want to assume too much either way without knowing what happened, but... I mean, I'm... And I know you don't want to hear this either, but I'm sure you'll, you'll end up finding somebody else. I mean, every time you come in here, you seem like a cool person, so... And I'm sure there's going to be somebody out there for you. At the same time, don't rush into anything new. You gotta let, uh, you gotta try to let this heal and stuff for a bit. A lot of people make a mistake of just on, jumping Grindr. into something new right doing? away. And then that relationship usually ends up going to shit. Because they've never fully gotten over the last one. And it's not fair to you, it wouldn't be fair to the next so person, down. it's just something... What's wrong with you? Something, something shitty. I don't know! It's like something hit me! And I, I do what? hope you get better tomorrow, like, you've been sick a while. I've actually been feeling slightly better today, too, now that you mention it, about all this sickness. Because you have a job interview with uh, Shell on Thursday. Ooh, job interview, good luck. I hope you get it. Oh, they're invisible. They're kind of invisible. But they actually do go full-blown invisible, don't they? I apologize, because I didn't realize this was going to get right into action. I try to keep up on stream as much as I can, so... As soon as this battle's over, I'm going to be reading everything. Everything! Oh, shit. Is it dead? No, it's still alive. I didn't hit it hard enough. Fuck. Oh, man, I'm almost out of assault rifle. Here we got this shoddy. Oh fuck. Dude loads a shotgun really fast. 
It's like he was loading two rounds at a time. These are some next level hunters right here. Next level. Invisibility, they take a lot more shots than any other hunter I've seen. I don't think there's any more. All right, here we go. Let's get to the terminal on the plane before any more monsters. Oh yeah, that job interview. Good luck on that. Seriously. I wonder who I can sell my current 1072 and for how much as well. Um I would just start to look on like eBay and maybe the Amazon use section get an idea of what it people are selling it for and then go off of that too also if it's still under warranty you can add that in there um, so you don't have to discount the price terribly too much it's 1070 still a bitchin card North at a gas station hey I don't know what's up but I hope you are okay oh yeah true for sure as an receptionist or a financial advisor I went through a break of what happened. What happened? Because I know all about the heart pain of a trail can learn. So just gotta make sure you don't become bitter. Yeah. <sighs> oh, true. Like, I, I know that's gotta be so tough. And saying, saying almost anything right now. Oh fuck! Just a grenade. Saying almost anything about it right now, I'm sure is not gonna necessarily help either, either way, because it's it just happened to you, you know, yesterday. Everything's still so fresh, but. You know, I'm sure you'll find somebody really good. Once all this settles down, and again, don't rush it, you'll find somebody really good. And, you know, this... This whole thing can hopefully end up being as shitty as it is. Somewhat of a, a learning experience as well. I mean, just... So, who, whoever you do end up with next, you can evaluate what happened. You know, I'm not saying it's yours or or theirs. You know, I don't know the situation, but it's at the end of the day, it's going to make you a stronger person. As shitty as it is, and this is shitty. This is a shitty fact about life. Shitty fact I even hate admitting. But how do we get that open? But really crappy events in life, like the most painful bullshit events a person can go through in life, is what tends to build character and makes a person stronger. And just, just really adds to the personality. And it sucks, because it is the shittiest events in life that do that, but... It's just one of the sad nature of things. Okay. Everything appears to be in working order. Yo, Quinn. Time to do your job. Hey, there's Jackass. Find the call log. I'll have to try something else. Just let. 36. How many relationships the did you have? On the other hand. 3. Oh, you're watching me and right Cap at the same time? What's going on? Yeah, I was watching Cap HQ before I started today. HQ here. O'Brien speaking. What's All ended in heartbreak. When you have time, can you send me photos of the movie collection? Oh, hey, I gotta get around to taking. I know you've been asking for a little bit here, and I'm not ignoring you. I just... I get so sidetracked and busy in my life. It's, it's nothing that I'm... That's blatantly ignoring you. I'll try to get around to it later today. I didn't calculate anything. I've just been crazy busy over this past couple weeks. And I'm on vacation too, and I've been crazy busy. Wait. But what are you talking about? You're saying Beltro ran from their own hideout, and now they're looking for their own ship? That's Thank you, Smog. I appreciate that. Seriously, but I have thank no you. no idea if any of the info I gleaned is for real or not. Great. So we have no idea really who we're up against. Exactly. And that's a piece of the puzzle we really need. You, uh... 
Chris here. First two didn't hurt that bad. The first two may or may not have been you know, together that long. Ryan, we're on our way. The longer you're with somebody, that that exit is exponentially more painful than the previous times. That was the end of the episode? That was short as fuck. Yeah, six minutes. Look at that. Six minutes. I wasn't even paying attention to the cutscenes. Now I'm going to be lost. Uh, how much uh, time... Yourself or these two? It's one of those things where you'll feel like shit about it for a month. There isn't much way around it. Yeah, I mean, and it may even be longer than a month. I mean, I, I don't want to make it sound shittier than it is. Maybe that's the worst thing I could have said. Um, it takes time. I'll just word it like that. It takes a long time to get over things, and it's it's going to be really, really shitty at first, and it will get easier with time, and it's just super important to take that time. And use this time to focus on yourself. Like, granted, for probably the next week or two, you're not going to want to probably do much. But you should try to hang out with with friends if you can. Though if they tell you to get out there and start dating immediately, don't listen to that. Because a lot of people tend to give that advice, and it's like the worst advice you can give. Um... Just do stuff you like doing normally. If it's you like watching people stream, do that. You like going out with friends, do that. You like just doing whatever. Try to get out, do that as much as you can. Um, sleep generally seems to help because it'll help the mind process things and uh, and get through things a little bit quicker. Usually, anyway. Um, let's see here. Go ahead and hit next on this. Months to be 11 years this month with her. Aww. Previously on Resident Evil Revelations. But some more superficial. Otherwise, what I'm, I'm going to let so this play here because we just saw yeah, this. For five years, had less health? pain and suffered than my current, which is is uh, three, five years now. I have a very token. deep bonding. Nice and stronger mental the connection, emotional, etc. That's nice. What, the? what happened? Sleep hurt, she's always there when you sleep. You know, that's kind of like the double-edged sword of sleep as well. Because all that sleeping is like your mind dealing with it and thinking about it, which in turn hurts, but then it's also dealing with it at the same time. And dealing with it, dealing with anything is what a lot of people just try to avoid in life. It's why a lot of people end up drinking turning to drugs, turning to whatever it is so they don't have to focus and dwell on things. And it's that not actually taking the time to go at it head on and deal with it that makes it actually last longer and make it harder. You know, there, there is no ripping the band-aid off in this sort of a situation, but it, ignoring the band-aid at the same time by trying to do stuff to take your mind off of it, ends up being uh, less productive than one would hope. If that makes sense. I hope that makes sense. Depending on how... What was that? Oh, that's my computer being stupid. What is that? You hear that? Where could they be? Anywhere. Let's get started. I think my computer's wigging out. Hey, are we Chris now? Are we finally Chris? Finally Chris, and we made it on the boat. I'm on a boat! Um, dealing with her deal with some people. Both themselves, folks I'm going to uh, affect other people because they hop in other relationships because they hate loneliness. You can do what feels best for you and your health. No plan. I mean, that's that's very true. You definitely need to do whatever you feel is best. I can only give you, like, little ideas, and anybody else can only give you ideas and things to do and suggestions and, and, and uh, I don't know, tips. But we're not you, obviously. <laughs> um, 
Only you are going to know what is going to work best for you. But I would try to take at least some of the stuff uh, said in stream today, whether it be from me or anybody in chat. And, and consider that as well when going through this stuff. I mean, nothing is going to make the pain go away. Any of the stuff that would probably make the pain go away at this stage probably isn't things you should necessarily be doing if you get my drift. But it's it's just going to take time, buddy. I really wish you the best. I'm deeply sorry this happened. And, um, you know, we're, we're here for you. You're always welcome in the channel. You can vent, you can talk about it, you can do whatever you just need a place to go to talk um and f you know also if stream's not on and you feel comfortable with talking to the people that are in the community here feel free to chat in the discord i mean i try to check it a couple times a day um i know other people are on during the day too they may be able to just you know say something here or there but you know, I, I really like the community that that everybody's come and uh, come to make here. Everyone's been super supportive, super nice. We capture them and interrogate them. Hopefully, that can at least give you some level of comfort. We got a ship interior map, guys. Mental health is most important. Absolutely, absolutely, it does. It hurts. Everything hurts. There. I know. I wish there was something I could say. What the hell keeps disconnecting? Hold on, we gotta figure what this is. I swear to God, if it's this bullcrap razor mouse janking out on me. I don't see... Um, here. Quietly move your notifications so you're done with your game. Yeah, turn off now. I think that's what I want. And thanks, Windows, I guess, for trying to mute things. I hope it stops. Like, that's really annoying. Is it gonna go back? Okay. True Prime, try to remember the good memories that try to fade away, but it doesn't mean the person has to be out of your heart and make sure... You distance yourself from a friend. Why is her working though? She is nothing to them but one travel. So she's Malaysia. Yeah. She's still traveling and reinventing herself. Yeah, absolutely true. Every everybody here is, is super supportive. I fucking love this community that we've got going here. Everyone's so great. Oh shit. What is... What is this? Windows, what the fuck are you doing to me? Like, is it this focus thing? Is this what's what beeping on me? I'll turn that shit off right now. Let's watch. If that's the only notification, we'll turn that off. Oh, it's so irritating. Yeah. Is it the only notification? What is it? Did you see that? What was that? Fuck, I gotta clip that and look at it, because we gotta stop this. It's gonna ruin the stream. Channel. Clip. Let's see if I can figure out what that said. Yeah, there it is. Shit, I missed it. Fuck, it's quick.
trying to catch it. It's like... There we go. Alright, what does that say? The USB device... Uh, this computer has malfunctioned. Windows does not recognize it. That has to be the stupid Razer mouse. Hold on a second, guys. Let me unplug this piece of crap. I hate Razer products. Okay, I've unplugged everything except my keyboard and my, uh, my secondary mouse. Let's hope that bullshit stops. Damn, that's irritating. New mutation. A reaction to a new virus. Oh shit, we're gonna die. Oh shit. Oh shit, I've been troubleshooting. Reload, reload, Chris. Holy crap. Oh fuck. Is that all of them? No, there's more. Fuck. What the hell is this? Chris, come, on. come on, what? Are they just gonna keep coming? Oh, man. It's important to find your... My nose keeps itching. I keep scratching it all day. Um... I don't have to just what you love. Zodiac sign. If it wasn't such a mess right now, it's a crack a joke. Um, but Razer loves you. Spend two hundred dollars on their overpriced keyboards and mice. Scar is big. You like Razer, you know? If you if you've had good luck with Razer, that's great. I, I feel really happy that at least someone's been having good luck with Razer. I have personally had just about nothing but problems no heels with razor products i bought a, i have a razor black widow chroma keyboard that i didn't even realize it until probably a few months after i bought it that a couple keys just don't work they don't work now i had already thrown the box away and i called razor support about it and they're like oh yeah well just ship it back to us and we'll get it i'm like well how am i supposed to ship it like, are you guys paying for the shipping? No, you gotta pay for the shipping. Okay, are you gonna send me a box? No, you have to supply the box. I'm like, what box is gonna fit a keyboard? I don't have the original box anymore. Yeah, sorry, you gotta supply the box and pay the shipping. I'm like, well, fuck. So, I just never sent it back. So, I have a couple keys that don't work. A couple keys that stick. It was like really poor QA on this keyboard. Um, and then I had a Razer Death Aider mouse, or I still do, it's right in front of me, that worked, it seemed to work fine for about a year, and then it just decided to take a dump, and it won't work anymore, it keeps giving, like you heard it just janking out right there, it just keeps malfunctioning, having problems, I haven't moved it, I haven't done anything with it that should have caused it to, to just all of a sudden break, but it did. So it's just, uh, you know. Just not a huge fan of Razer. Um, let's see here. Uh, you're a Cancer. No, you're not. I'm a Cancer. Zodiac sign is Cancer. Oh. oh. Well, you have a problem with... Well, I do have a problem with your Razer Mamba. The laser stops working. See, Scarspick, that's kind of what I'm talking about. Like, their QA department is shit. 
Like, their stuff looks amazing. I will never say Razer products do not look amazing. Their RGB is the best looking in the business, by far. By leaps and bounds, it looks gorgeous. But... Their products all have issues. And then they have laptops. Like, have you seen the Razer laptops? They're gorgeous, right? Some of the best looking laptops I've ever seen. But they overheat because they're too thin and they can't do proper cooling on them. Yet they'll put like 1080s in there and the most high power chips and they can't cool them. And what cooling it does have sounds like a jet engine. It is the most ridiculously loud sounding fans I have ever heard on a laptop, ever. I don't even know who they're kidding. It's like, why even try to make a laptop all thin and nice looking if it's just going to overheat? It's like you just made a big paperweight. You offended it. That's why it spazzed out. I just want this to be a bad dream. Well, I mean, I know you said it was complicated earlier when I'd asked, um... If it seemed like there might be any any chance, so I'm I'm gonna take that as probably you mean that as a no. So I mean it's it's rough. I I know I can imagine how you must feel. I'm so sorry. I really truly am. I think I get too sweaty in the later messes up. That's that's no excuse. Scars. It should just work. So I bought a uh, keyboard Jessica. for my work. Um, yeah, uh, hold on. I actually Judge went all out and bought a, I believe a problem with the Corsair K95 for my office. To get them going again. I love that keyboard that so sense. much. We'll head down there now. If I ever buy a new keyboard, it's going to be a Corsair. It's absolutely going to be a Corsair keyboard. Mice, too. I might buy a Corsair mouse. I used to say Razer at least had good mice, but... I, I'd have to take that back, too. Okay, that's the casino. Did we just go through the casino? Where's my map? Seriously, where's, where's my map? Oh, here we go. Yeah, I think we have to go through the casino. Casino? Got a handgun, shock. I guess shotgun's pretty much the only thing we have right now. I guess that's it. Shit, I never took this off. Okay, there we go. There we go. Casino. It's a really small casino. I mean, I know it's on a boat. So how much could you really ask for? But it seems overly, overly tiny. What's that mean? Holy crap. <laughs> you hear her? Stay the hell away, ugly. Damn, I just uppercutted the shit out of that thing. God, these things just don't die easy, do they? Fuck. Dude, look at this shit. Like, oh my god. Oh, fuck. Of course we're out of ammo. Of course. Punching weird things. I don't know how many shots we're going to have to do on these things. We fought them as a Jill. 
We unloaded every last round of ammunition we had. Fuck. Do I have any more grenades? I have no more nades. I only have pistol ammunition left. It died! It died off the fucking pistol. Hyper punch. Oh my god. Oh, fucking finally. Jesus. Trident key. That took forever. That didn't work. Because it's already been pressed. Alright, where are we going here? There's no time for that! Chris. Hey, Demarty, how you doing today? Thank you so much for that host! I hope your day is going... going well. Demarty raided me with a party of... Thank you very much, Elis! Twitch is so weird with their raid and their host stuff, like... Your raid should have been the same size as your host, right? But for some reason it showed right. two different sizes. But, it's already infected the ship. but thank you so much. F! How you doing? How's your day going? It's a good thing you're not supposed to... It extremely is very good that that's not a thing right now, but true, just in case... I mean, of course, we're here for you, and I did, of course, say the Discord is always open for you if you need somebody to talk to, but nobody here, of course, is probably a professional. Oh, I'll say it like that. Um, if you do, by any chance, start to feel that way, and you do feel you need somebody to talk to, this is a link I use during my suicide prevention streams. Please feel free to reach out to any of the resources on either of these two. They're both just no- wait, I'm sorry, that's not the right link. That's not the right link at all. This is the right link. Um, a lot of good phone numbers there for people. I, I'm, I can't remember if you're in the States or if you're overseas. First link is for the States, the second link on the Bipolar Foundation is for overseas. For people there that are qualified 